As part of his cabinet's new plan to address concerns over looming electricity shortages, Premier Lai Ching De vowed to ensure stable power supply while promising that expanded renewable energy capacity would not lead to bigger electricity price hikes in the future. As part of his bid to address major shortfalls in Taiwan's investment environment, Lai also announced plans to improve air quality while moving toward a nuclear-free Taiwan by 2025. Premier Lai Qingde was back in front of reporters today to firm up the details of his cabinet's plan to address the looming threat of blackouts and brownouts across Taiwan. Reaching a reserve margin of 15 percent and an operating reserve of 10 percent will depend on the electricity supply from the generators that we normally keep online, as well as the timely completion of new generators. The cabinet's proposal to relieve the tight electricity supply includes plans to expand renewable generation capacity, including by loosening regulations on solar panels installed on roofs and promoting offshore wind farms and methane power generation. The proposals will also include a public outreach element meant to further promote the idea of saving power among the general public. Outside observers were wondering if the increase in renewable generation capacity would cause hikes in electricity prices. The costs of renewable energy constructions are gradually falling because of advances in technology. Second, as for whether overall electricity prices will be affected by these new construction projects, electricity prices over the next 10 years won't be much different overall compared to prices over the past decade. In light of its plans to decommission all the nation's nuclear power plants by 2025, the cabinet is working to ensure that electricity supply remains stable, setting a goal of building up a reserve margin of 15 percent and an operating reserve of 10 percent by 2019.